In the ancient city of Babylon, tourists are trickling back. That follows the Iraqi government ending the need for pre-arrival visa from dozens of countries. This is a replica of Babylon as it's thought to have looked like in 600 BC. Little is left of the original structure, but tourists are fascinated by 4,000 years of Mesopotamia's cultural heritage. A lot of people back in Ireland don't even know that Babylon is in Iraq. They don't even know it's still a real place, you know? So it's so incredible to be able to come here. This is what remains of the hanging gardens of Babylon, one of the seven wonders of the ancient world. The original and renowned Ishtar Gate was shipped off to Berlin by European archaeologists at the beginning of the last century. Archaeologists say numerous historical treasures are waiting to be discovered across Iraq. Here in this area, for an instance, there are ancient ruins beneath these surrounding palm groves and villages. They're threatened by oil pipelines running through them and encroachments by local residents. Ur was the cultural heartland of ancient Mesopotamia. It's revered as the birthplace of Prophet Abraham and gained international attention following last year's visit by the head of the Catholic Church, Pope Francis. Yeah, and I think even more from, from my parents, they, they were quite nervous. They, they asked, why are you going to Iraq and um, is it going to be safe? Um, but the people have been so friendly, it's very welcoming. Um, so from my point of view, it's a great country to visit. Thousands of priceless artifacts have been looted or smuggled out of Iraq. Ancient temples, palaces and tombs, either destroyed by ISIL or damaged under the watch of consecutive governments. Cultural tourism was blooming before the 2003 US-led invasion, but we've recently received several Western excavation missions that have helped a lot in discovering and protecting many sites. They've also highlighted the importance of Or as a centre for interfaith and destination for tourists from various backgrounds. A resurgence of tourism means creating new development projects and job opportunities for many here. These pieces are handcrafted by young people who have no other jobs to do. So we count on the government to help bring tourists back so that we can keep the business afloat. And continue to maintain the immortal memory of ancient Mesopotamia, even though much of its magnificence has been lost to decades of chaos and neglect. Mahmoud Abdelwahid, Al Jazeera, in Babylon City. Central Iraq.